Since 1947, the schooner has been serving up the freshest of seafood and Cajun flavors. The old photos and menus on the wall, along with the same old taxidermized fish I remember from when I was a kid, let every customer know that the schooner knows seafood. Constantine Megas and his kids carry on the Megas family tradition. Greek immigrants serving up Cajun seafood. Hey, I told you this place was a melting pot. And here's Constantine and his daughter, Maria. I came here in 1952 and I've been here ever since. A big Greek family serving Cajun food. That's yeah. right. That is <laughs> Southeast right. Texas. If you yeah. know anything about Greek people, you know that we love to feed people. So restaurants yeah. just come naturally. And they treat every table as if it were in their home, taking the utmost care with every dish. We fillet snapper, flounder, we peel our own shrimp, we shuck our own oysters, yeah. we make everything here in house. Yeah. Old school. Old school. I mean, really old school. We didn't change any of that. Yeah. So I saw the old menus on the wall. How much were oysters back then? They were 10 cents. 10 cents an oyster, yeah. <laughs> 10 cents a dozen. <laughs> oh, 10 cents a dozen? A dozen. Yeah. Oh gosh, you're like, just give them away. There, I think there are seafood platters on there for like two bucks. We're buying shrimp for five cents a pound. Then. Wow, that's <laughs> awesome. But we've seen generations dine with us. So my dad has seen parents, you know, grandparents, parents, children, grandchildren now celebrating all types of family events. They've grown up with us here in the restaurant. That's awesome. The schooner is truly an icon of Southeast Texas. And while every dish looks amazing, well, I'm here for a specialty that's only found in Southeast Texas, barbecued crabs. Invented in Sabine Pass, this local delicacy consists of blue crabs tossed in a zesty seasoned flour and deep fried. Now, I know that confuses many of you barbecue purists out there. I mean, there's no smoke, no fire, but hey, you can't argue with the golden brown deliciousness that is barbecued crabs. Oh, yeah. <laughs> This guy's a little bigger than the one we caught today at Sea Rim. There's a lot of meat in here if you know how to get to it. You see that? See that in there? It's like this succulent sweet crab meat with like a little bit of zesty Cajun sauce. You gotta get your whole hands in there and really get after it. And as you get into it, you just start kind of licking the fingers as you go through. Mm. That, my friends, is delicious. See, now that's a good bite. Got a little bit of breading on. Come on, little crab. Open yourself to my belly. Le poisson, le poisson. Wee, wee, wee. Oh. And when you're left with like a pile of crab guts and dust, then you know it's time to move on to the next one. Oh. You're supposed to be eating it like with friends at a table who are also eating the food, and y'all are not eating. Y'all are just kind of staring at me eating, eating this. And so I get to pass along the tradition.